Alright, hey guys, Paxer and sorry that I haven't uploaded in like two weeks. I was trying to achieve a power far better than Ultra Instinct, and yeah, I'm back with a new video. And as the title states, I'll be checking out a pretty old world. It's a parkour made by Hamumu, and it is pretty cool to see, like, I, I recently found this out uh, again after a while, so I just wanted to share it out and just just check it out, okay? This world is it's worth checking out, in my opinion. Just, just, it's a fun little parkour you can check out if you have time. Uh, but before we get into the parkour, I actually want to... I want to share some... So before I start the parkour, also again, rest in peace, Artisa Farms. Um, I just wanted to go over the a bit of context of this world. So Grotech Pharma, it was made around more than almost eight years ago, really. It's it's really crazy, but yeah, it's very it's a very old world, as you can see, made by Hamumu, former team member. And we're going to get right into this. Seems like something big is going down at Grotech Pharmacy. I'm not going to call it Pharma. If going down to Facebook is too much work for you, then check this out. It really is. No one uses Facebook anymore. A mole on the inside of Grotech Pharma has, Pharmacy has smuggled out this internal memo. To all players for immediate release, blah 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 blah. You guys can pause this if you want to read it. Your boss, Mr. Z. Um, so that, as you can see, this basically confirms that Grotopia is indeed relevant to Call of Duty and they are connected. They do share a connected universe. Also, a bit a bit of trivia. So apparently, there's a burglar at the end of the. There's actually a burglar NPC at the end of the, um, the parkour. We'll be going over it in a bit. And yeah, he. This is him right here. Look, this guy is basically, he's the godfather of most scammers. Um, yeah. So yeah, our goal is to just to beat the shit out of him. So we're gonna get to the end of parkour and just beat him up. We're just gonna have so much fun kicking this guy's ass for. For all the scammers, he's inspired basically, and yeah, it's gonna be fun. So if you guys didn't know, if you click on the telephone, any telephone doesn't matter, and if you type in the number zero two eight nine three, you can actually call Grotech Pharmaceuticals, and basically you can just you just press whatever you want. I'm just gonna press four right now because I'm a rebel. Um, get a job, you hippie. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna file a fucking. I'm gonna go out on this guy or girl. Um, uh, clearly, this game has a weird prejudice against hippies. I mean, most of them are retired now, so that kind of it's kind of irrelevant. Um, we're sorry, all our representatives are currently assisting nobody at all. They don't feel like assisting you either. Please hold for the next operator that feels like talking to you. Okay. Bruh. Alright, so without further ado, with everything out of the way, let's get right into this world. It's called Grotech Pharma, because pharmacy or pharmaceuticals is it's way too long, so they had to shorten it down. So let's go to this world, and as you can see, yeah, it looks very old. It looks like it's dying already with all the fire and shit just enveloping the world. There are no jammers at all, so that's how old this world is. Locked by Hamumu, and yeah, this is the prizes for the world. <laughs> you, you can win. You have a... Uh, 0% chance of getting either of these if you actually play, so yeah. Also, if you guys didn't know, this is this is a speedrun, okay? This is... I'm going for a world record pace in 2021 speedrun. Um, as you can see, this is... There we go. I have the speedrun in timer. And I don't know how to start it, so it's gonna... I'm just as clueless as you guys. Um, if you guys want to know all the passwords, I'll be going over all the passwords as... This is basically a walkthrough, okay? If you guys didn't know. Um, I didn't know. I just, I just figured it out. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna be starting. This is gonna be a speed run. No nonsense speed run. Oh, oh, there, there we go. It's it started. First password D O T D. Don't ask me what that stands for. If you guys are curious how I know all the passwords, I, I basically just sucked up all the knowledge. As soon as I got into this world, I just I basically got all the knowledge into this world, and I know everything about it. Um, with that being said, this parkour, like overall, it is pretty crappy, but it's still pretty cool in my opinion. To see like it kind of shows what Grotopia is lacking nowadays and that's basically we need more developer interactions like this moderator interactions in my opinion a lot more or less corporate like okay next password I'm just kind of guessing right here but this number feels pretty good to me zero three zero four six three if you guys want to take a screenshot of that easy easy game but yeah honestly like compared to Hamumu and like during Seth and Seth Mumu's days basically and Ubisoft the thing they're kind of lacking is so Social interaction like sure they did speed like not speed runs what the fuck live streams and shit next one is Eiffel like Eiffel Tower 
just that easy. But it still feels very different in my opinion um, compared to Seth and Hamumu's days. Like during this time, they, you can clearly see some heart they put into this. And yeah, but like nowadays, all they really do is just they basically just host giveaways and shit. And it's just it's really crazy. And this I don't know what the term for this is, but I'm just kind of blanking out in world words right now. But it does feel kind of just random. Like sometimes, like especially their giveaways too. Like sometimes they would just give away. This, sometimes they they would host giveaways and not give away anything at all. Like I don't get that. But then like under streams, they're just like, all right, you know what? You get a diamond dragon. Just fuck it, man. You get diamond dragons, and just, they just give away random. Sh it just seems like it just feels like a corporate face. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Um, next password is October. Um, my my second favorite month. So I just I just kind of put that there. But yeah, it's still kind of cool to see this. Sorry if I'm kind of rambling on. I, I'm on coffee as you can probably guess. And <laughs> yeah, I kind of ramble on when I drink coffee. But it really, it does show something like... Because like, if you look at other events Seth and Hamumu made, like... The Truth. If you guys didn't know, Discovering the Truth is an epic quest, like an epic goal. And it really does show like... You can see how much they, it's very cryptic. Was what I'm trying to say, and it kind of shows like how the lengths they went into making that. Next password is antibiotics because this is a pharmacy after all. And there we go. Alert! There's an intruder on this premise. Um, I'm just gonna stop rambling. <laughs> I could I could talk about this the whole day, but it's it's just a pork car, man. This is it's just I really like the heart they put into this. So. Yeah, sorry if I went in a bit of a tangent there, but if you guys want, I can I can probably make a whole video on that topic on its own. Or just talk about it on my live stream, which I, I do. Um, Twitch.tv slash Paxraw, if you guys are curious. Alright, so let's beat... Are you serious? Are, are you serious? Alright, my main goal for this video is to beat the shit out of this, this burglar, and apparently, apparently he's dead. Um, that was the main incentive of this whole journey to beat the shit out of this guy, and he's he's been dead for like eight years. This is this is nice. Um, okay, well this was nice. Like originally, I was gonna do like a weird skate where I just I punch the shit out out of him because apparently his famous last words were "I'll stop it," and that's the only thing he said. So I was gonna beat the shit out of him like my like beating up my unicorn. Um, that's not a euphemism, but yeah, that's that's kind of stupid in my opinion. I thought I expected him to be here, but yeah. You know what? You like warlocks, huh? You like warlocks? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna desecrate his fucking. You know, take this. You know, I heard you like. I heard you like uh, scamming. The godfather of scammers, right here. Take this shit. Take all my shit. All right, there we. <laughs> there we go. And just to add a little bit more. Boom. <laughs> That's what you get. That's what you get for scamming. That's what you get for being born as a scammer from Hamumu's brain. Um, so yeah, that was that was Grotech Pharma. If you guys want to check this out, it's a pretty cool world, really. Um, and yeah, try, if you want, you can try to beat my time. Okay, I kind of fooled around, but it's, it's a very easy world. As you can see, it takes me as long as to beat a wolf world as to beat this world. So it's not really, it's, it's basically a joke. But yeah, it's still pretty cool to see and... If you guys want, I'm, I'm actually thinking of doing more videos like this. It depends, really. Um, I'm pretty sure there are more worlds kind of like this, or at least very ancient parkour worlds. Um, I might do that. Just like I'll do like one video of that per week to just have a consistent uh, update schedule and upload schedule, and add on to just my basic shit I upload, which is kind of random. But yeah, emergency exit to kick you out. But yeah, that was the parkour, pretty good parkour from 2013 standards. So yeah, guys, hopefully you guys found this video very informative in a way and kind of funny. I don't know. I try to be funny, but I'm I'm literally about to pass out right now. So anyways, yeah, guys, it's a pretty short video and I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace.